The annual France-Singapore Festival, voila, returns for another season next month. And this year's festival will present over 30 programs in the domains of culture, education, science, lifestyle, tourism, and sports. Well, joining us tonight with more is Ambassador of France to Singapore, Marc Abansour, as well as Janice Ko, she's patron of the Voila Festival. Welcome, both of you. Good to see you here today. Thank you. Well, uh, Ambassador, let, let's begin with you. It's been held for about 10 years or so, uh, this festival. Can you explain to us how the how these, this sort of collaborative partnership between Singapore and French institutions has grown over the years? It's a long time. Yeah. Well, first, I mean, thank you for uh, having us. And uh, I wanted to say how grateful I am, I mean, to have uh, Janisco uh, as our uh, patron for Voila Festival this year. I think uh, Janice actually personifies what we try to achieve through Voila. I mean, uh, this uh, collaboration. Uh, I mean, uh, Janice is a very well-known actress. I mean, we, most of us, I mean, so uh, crazy rich Asians. But uh, Janice also played in a French play a year ago called The Reunification of the Two Koreas. Mm. It's a French play. It was performed in English here with Singaporean comedians. And then you, was, you were on a tour in France. And so it's clearly, I mean, uh, um, the concretization of mm. this collaboration. So that's what we want to do through all the different uh, mm. events uh, through uh, Voila. And uh, this year, I mean, uh, we decided to uh, revamp uh, Voila. So it's getting bigger. It's more uh, attractive, more impactful. And it's not limited to art and culture. Uh, as you said, I mean, science, education, gastronomy as mm. well. <laughs> Quite there a is more than a lineup of 30 programs, actually. It's so over 50 programs. Mm -hmm. And uh, with a, a group of partners, which is exceeding on 100. And, uh, and we want to use this as a channel, I mean, to uh, foster collaboration between uh, France and Singapore in all these uh, different fields. Right. Janice, so tell us, um, help us understand, what does a patron, you know, do at a festival like this? <laughs> Attend as many shows as possible. <laughs> <laughs> sure. um, and, well, I'm, I'm really on board because I really like the new direction that the festival is going towards, which is partnerships and collaboration. And we all know that as the world gets smaller, everyone is more well-traveled, we are much more exposed to different world cultures, but it's quite a different thing to work together mm -hmm. on a project and on a collaboration, which I think requires a lot more, uh, a, a lot deeper engagement. It might require more authentic conversations, mm -hmm. which might include resolution of conflict and I think that creates a much deeper connection which I feel in today's climate is far more meaningful and necessary. Mm. Yeah. There's such a wonderful diversity to all of the events that are in this festival this year as you mentioned about 50 of them. Can you maybe tell us a little bit more mm. about what's so special and different about this year's lineup? Yeah. Well first we will celebrate also uh, several uh, anniversaries uh, just to give you a few examples, I mean, the uh, 30th anniversary of uh, French Singapore cooperation on heritage conservation. Uh, you know Chimes. Yes. I mean, uh, it was a collaboration also between uh, the French Ministry of Culture and the National Heritage Board here. Uh, another example, National Gallery. So after 30 years, uh, we will celebrate that. Uh, we will also celebrate uh, the anniversary of Alliance Francaise. Mm. Uh, 70 years, uh, actually, it was founded 70 years mm -hmm. ago. But we will celebrate also a very important anniversary, which is 200 years of cooperation between France and Singapore on natural history. Because we found out that uh, Stamford Raffles came to Singapore accompanied by two French naturalists. Mm. Their names are Jar and Duvocel. And when they uh, arrived here in Singapore, they documented the fauna and flora of Singapore. So we found out we rediscovered, I mean, their drawings and their manuscripts. Mm. And so it will be shown in Singapore at the National Normal Museum. And the Le Contienne uh, Museum, attached to NUS, will uh, edit a book with their drawings and also a survey of 100 years of French naturalist mm. uh, journey here in Singapore and in the region. That's right. right. And, and, and in fact, those two French biologists that you speak of, uh, th their work here led to the first description of the Malayan tapir here Correct. in Singapore, exactly. of this region. So, so yes, yeah, yeah. so a lot to learn, a lot to understand as well. But what can festival goers just in general, um, you know, expect to see at the event, at the various events that will be happening? 
Well, there is a, a long list, but just, I mean, to give you a few examples, I mean, the, the opening will be with a, a concert uh, with a very uh, well-known uh, French uh, cellist, Gauthier Capuçon, uh, with uh, Vladimir Ashkenazi as a, a conductor. And they, were, they will perform the 3rd of October uh, with the SSO, Singapore Symphony Orchestra. Uh, the, the cellist will play the Schumann, Schumann Concerto. Uh, and, and then there is uh, also uh, an exhibition on design at the National Design Center mm. uh, with uh, 40 uh, masterpieces by uh, Philippe Stark, uh, Jean-Paul Gaultier, many others. There will be always workshop and uh, designers from France, Singapore, getting together and engaging in, uh, in discussion on this. So Janice, real quick, you know, what, will be, what, what, what are some of your, your favorites that we should be looking out for? Well, the things that kind of jumped up at me were, um, one of them is called The Bear's Mouth, and it's a procession of really big, illuminated, giant bears that go through um, Gardens by the Bay um, with dancers. And I think that's uh, something which is great it's free, it's great for the whole family, mm. for a night out, and it's very Instagram friendly. So I think that's quite fun. The other thing that jumped out at me was, I believe you, the festival is inviting uh, the last artisanal butter maker <laughs> in oh, France, wonderful. who still makes butter by hand. It. Yeah. yeah, and uh, I think that's quite, um, it would be fascinating to hear about his passion and what makes that kind of butter different. So right. he's doing a little workshop and a dinner at Atu, the restaurant. And lastly, I have a soft spot for film festivals. Mm -hmm. So the French Film Festival is now part of Voila. Mm -hmm. and uh, you know, it will always showcase the latest from the French box office. So I would, you know, probably catch a film. Right. Well, looking forward yeah. to all that. So if you want to catch that, the festival will run from October 3rd to November 17th. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for, for having speaking us. with Ambassador of France to Singapore, Marc Abansor, and Janice Co, patron of this year's Vola.